what is up guys and welcome back to the channel if you're new to the channel please go ahead hit that subscribe button you know what to do also hit that like button to help us out here on the channel on the nerd jock but today guys um well tonight it's almost the next day here we're about to stream a gore fest of the quarry we're gonna try to play as much through as we can and this is the Gorious, the most gruesome way these characters can die and we're just gonna have a blast here today got the jack daniels got the water ready gotta stay sober at the same time too guys can't gotta stay you know aware of everything here but let's go ahead and get into it let's start this game up right now here on the nerd jock Why'd you kill the music? I think you know why. Um, <laughs> I don't think I do. It begins with an L? Like the L word? Lesbians? Lost, lost Max, we're lost. We're just, we're in geographic flux. Right, so, lost. That's debatable. Oh, that's a, oh, damn. Just hit a nice damn pothole. Oh. I'm not the one who hit the pothole. Well, maybe the pothole hit us. Ever think about that? Wow, that is like Olympic level goalpost moving. Thank you. Very impressive. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, still totally lost. <sighs> you know what, Max? It's okay. It doesn't make you any less of a man. You know, if Columbus hadn't gone lost and landed on these golden shores, there would be no United States of America. Goodbye, hot dogs. See you later, apple pie. Columbus never actually landed in North America. What are you talking about? Didn't even know he wasn't in Asia. Are you serious? Just another guy who didn't want to admit he was lost. Well, just another guy who's got a whole day named after him, so... Put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh my god, okay, just get us to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. <laughs> I'm working on it, I'm working on it. What is that? Yeah, yeah. No, but seriously, how what happened to the, the normal map? This is the normal map. The one on the phone. No bars. Of course not. Okay, let's see. So we are... Well, I guess they don't put summer camps on maps. 
Have you seen any signs for it? Kind of cute. Hey, eyes on the road. Oh, oh bam. Oh. Hey guys, Ooh. are you okay? You okay? All right. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. I mean, still in one piece. Jesus Christ! What do you think that was? Oh man. A bear? What? A possum? No, no, Max. It wasn't no. a bear. What was it? What was it? What was it? It was a person. What? What a person? Oh, are you serious? Do you think we had a person? What? Oh no. I don't know. I mean, it was really cl close, like really close, but maybe we didn't. What? We couldn't have hit a person. <gasps> I'm going to jail. What is it? I don't know, girl. I really have this car up. Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Uh. I should check out the damage before we try to start it up again, huh? Could you grab my, uh, the, the toolbox from the trunk? Yeah, yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. Grab that toolbox, girl. It's not so bad. My mom's gonna kill me. Thanks, huh? Yeah. Do you need a hand? Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light right here. Yep. There you go. Perfect, thank you. Oh, thanks, girl. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself curling up in front of a big old fire pit singing campfire sing-alongs. I don't think people curl up right in Kumbaya. front of big old fire pits. Why not? Uh, they don't want to catch on fire. And then picture yourself curling up in front of a big old space heat. Oh shit, someone's watching us from the woods. Well, anywhere's better than here. Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? Where are you going? Just over here. Just stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. Well, she's not the boss of me. I just don't want you wandering off on your own. Excuse me. Yeah. That's not what I meant. Yeah, it better not be. I, I'm sorry. I, I really got to concentrate for a second, okay. okay? Yes. Look, I think there's someone down there, okay? What's that? They what? could be hurt. Oh. Okay. I'm going to go check it out. Don't die. Good idea, Laura. So thoughtful of you. Oh! Damn. Didn't see the pothole there.
the hell? Yeah, what's going on here? The hell is that? Oh, shit. S -s -x dog boy. Dog boy? Oh, shit. What was that? What was that? Oh, oh damn. Where are you? Show yourself. Silence. Oh, hell no. Run. Oh. What kind of voodoo did you bring back with you? Car. Now. Yeah. Now. Okay. Did you see it? No, but I heard something. Let's just get out of here. Yeah, let's get out of here. This scary AF. Come on. Come on, turn on. Damn Come, it. you said you checked it. I did check it, and it was fine. Honey, I know you're on edge, but you gotta calm down, okay? I am not on edge, Max. I'm freaking the fuck out. It was probably just an animal or something. No, it wasn't an animal. You didn't see it. It was a woman. No, this isn't helping, all right? Calm down. Go! There we go. We're good. See? Please just get us out of here. Okay. All right. All right. Oh, man. Max! I'm trying. Oh I'm trying. Give me one sec, girl. I got this. We're okay. Yeah, we're not going anywhere. Sorry. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Jeez! Oh! Oh! oh fuck. Shit! Oh my god, my heart just exploded. Dude, where'd you come from, you damn Roll hick? it down. Hi, officer. How Ooh. are you doing this evening? Are Get either of you injured? No. Me, uh, man. Well, she bumped her head. Well, barely, barely bumped it. I mean, I, can, I can't even feel it. Man. My bump, not my head. I'm Ooh. fine. Really, we're fine. We're just a little shaken yeah, we're up. we're fine. Mm. Dude scared me. Well, you folks want to tell me what happened here? Nothing. Nothing. Nothing at all. Right? 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 Uh, well, we were just driving, and it's really, really dark out here. And, yeah, man. Um, I don't know. We, we must have had, like, a, a pothole or something, because we swerved, and now here we are. Yeah, I couldn't see anything. I mean, I'm, these roads are really not in great shape. Yeah. Sir? Get the car running. Okay. Sir? Weirdo. That dude's kind of weird. Is this guy like the all-time scariest cop? I don't know. This is my first cop. What, like ever? Uh, yeah, I'm not a criminal. Sure, you're not a criminal. Bro, you just had pot back there down the road.
Now you folks want to tell me just what in the hell you are doing all the way out here this late at night. We were just taking in the sights, officer. Yeah, looking at the crime? deer. Ma'am, I'm going to take it by the tone of your voice that you were unaware that this is an open season hunting zone until tomorrow. Hey, man. Hey. Oh, Calm down. Shit. Uh, no, didn't know that. <laughs> we were kind of lost, actually. What is your intended destination? We're headed up to Hackett's Quarry. Yeah. Just mm. down south. Not the camp. What? It's a free place to stay, so. Yeah, yeah. man. Like, we're allowed to stay there. <laughs> You're not going to make it to Hackett's Quarry. Uh, yeah, I not am. Not tonight. Yes, I am. Bear back off. Harbinger Motel. It's the nearest place you can bunk up there for the night, okay? Whoa, 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 uh, dude. I'll I think go. we're just going to stick to the plan, sir. I mean, Mr. Hackett knows we're coming and yeah. we called ahead. No, yeah. ma'am, you're going to head to the Harbinger Motel. Do you understand? Oh, man. Calm down. With all due respect, sir, why can't we go to Hackett's Quarry? Because I told you to go to the motel. Whoa, man. Okay, I just don't understand what the problem- Ma'am, please step out of the vehicle. Whoa, what? whoa, dude. Why? Officer, she didn't do anything. Come on, man. Ma'am, if you wouldn't mind stepping out of the vehicle, I would just like to show you a route on your map there. Whoa, 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 whoa. We know where we're going, man. Okay. This dude's weird. Sure. Just be careful. Son, remain in the vehicle. So okay. careful, man. Okay. So we uh huh. Ew. That's all right about here. Harbinger uh -huh. Motel. Okay. Is here. Right, uh -huh. okay, and where was Hackett's Quarry again? Well, I'm sure the fine folks at the Harbinger Motel can guide you there. Okay. First thing in the morning. I'm trying to go now. Like, come on, dude. Still, please. Dude, what are you doing? Like, that's totally weird. Like. What are you doing? Dude. Keep your hand inside your pocket. Like, don't. Hold. Still. Dude. What? What are you doing? No. Dude. 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 Dude, don't. Yeah. Dude, don't. Dude, stop touching me. It's totally weird. Fresh as a daisy. No, I'm not. I'm as dirty as a You can return to the vehicle, ma'am. Harbinger Motel. Stay on the road. Watch out for potholes. Okay. Gotcha. Don't you need like Have a stable? Have a good night. 10-4. Asshole. <laughs> Dude was an a-hole. Like, like, right, Billy? Like, totally weird. Man. Why is this guy just sitting there? Thanks for all your help, though, back there. What you're is that welcome. supposed to mean? Yeah, you were shaking like a broken washing machine. I could have used a little backup. I mean, he clearly Whoa. liked you better. Well, I'm very likable. I thought you were down for that kind of shit, girl. Okay. Well, I'm sorry. All right, let's get back on the road. Yes. I think I've had enough woodland encounters for one night. Thank you very much. Agreed. So where's this motel? Okay, so we're here, mm -hmm. and the motel is here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then we're going here. What's there? Hackett's Quarry. Oh. How'd you do that? I don't know. I kind of tricked him into showing me. <laughs> very slick. Are you sure we shouldn't just get to the motel and just listen to this guy's advice? 
Honey, you really want to listen to the advice of some creep-ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep-ass woods to go to some creep-ass hotel? No, that sounds terrible. Yeah. Let's hit the road, shall we? That's what I thought. Ma'am? Oh my god! If he called me ma'am one more time, I was gonna shove that badge up his dick. <laughs> Seriously, do I look oh. like a ma'am to you? I got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm-hmm. Yep. What? I... 20 is debatable. Easy. I mean, I'm kind of into ma'ams. Okay, we're done here. <laughs> All right. Where are we going now? Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You gotta be kidding me. There's nobody here. We drive all the way the fuck out Max, here. Max, can we just look around before we jump to conclusions? Did you actually even talk to Mr. Hackett or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This. This is the difference. I mean, we chatted a little bit. Hello? I guess he doesn't check his voicemail. How was I supposed to know that? Uh -huh. Oh, excuse me. I'm so sorry. I mean, clearly there's somebody here. Yeah, or it's just an abandoned car and this is a complete waste Why of time. Why would there be an abandoned... I'll get the car. Max, come on. <clears throat> Max, don't be a dick. Man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Man, I thought we could chill here for a little bit. Come on. Mr. Hackett's here. I just talked to him on the phone. Car park, this is where we are, and okay, uh huh. Okay. Fun. Huh. Pretty fun. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. That's not a weird quote at all. <laughs> Keep on moving. Hey, you ready to roll? Let's go. Wait a second. I'm gonna check this out, cause you know me. I'm an explorer. Gotta see what's up. Are, are you okay in there? Are you okay? Hey! Hey, man. Hey, are you okay? Whoa, man. Are you fine? I'll be right back. I'm gonna get some help. Yeah. No. Leave. Okay? Totally weird. Get over here! What's going on? Yo, man, we gotta get the F There's out of here. There's somebody in the bunker. I think they might be stuck. No, stuck? no. Is get it Mr. Hackett? F out of I, here. I don't know. Just bring some tools so we can break the lock. Hey, I'm back. We're gonna get you out of there. Mm -mm. Hey. hey. No, we're Wait, not. What are these? I don't know. You just said tools. Why didn't you just bring. The... Mm -mm. Look, there's someone in there. Get the F out of there. Uh, You're gonna die. All right. I'm not seeing anyone. What? No, look. I'm looking, I am. Alright, I told you you're gonna die. I'm telling you, get the F out of there. There, there was definitely someone there. I don't care. Okay, okay, so... Get the F out of there. Gee. I'll take that one, but shit. Let me open it. You sure? Yeah. I'm, shit, yeah. I'm sure. Saw it online. Uh -huh. Oh, damn. Damn. I'm good. Shit. Hell yeah. Learn that you off of uh, yeah. breakintoyourmothershouse.com. Mm -hmm. You go first, dude. Come on, man. Don't make the lady go first. You've seen the Evil Dead, right? Nope. Never. Hello? Hello, 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 hello. Is anybody there? Are you hurt? Do you exist? Are you gonna kill us? Hey, be careful. Dude, I got my own back. You, like, left me alone. Okay. All right. I'm out. 
about. I'd be leaving right about now. Max? Nope. Get the F out of there. I'm telling you. Listen. Hun, maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was there was someone here, I swear. Mm-hmm. Hey. It's been kind of a night, you know? Let's just get to the motel. We can come back here first thing in the morning. We can check everything out, but... Yep. I mean, you must be exhausted. I know I am. I think our imagination... <laughs> oh, hey. Max? What was that? Max! Max! That's what? Hey man. What the hell was that? Hey man, what got you? I think I'm leaving alive. Yeah, I think you're dead, man. I'm out of here. <laughs> hey man, you're dead. I'm sorry. Oh no, man. You fucking dude. <laughs> But I'm dead now, shit. Every little movement, every little thing you do, is it slide of hand that commands my heart to love you? Every little movement, every motion of your hips, I feel the compulsion. To Query summer camp. Ladies, peace and love. See you later, kids. Yeah, Hackett's Quarry forever. Yeah, man. <laughs> you know how many hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance mm -hmm. apocalypse. Yeah, well, I mean, they're just kids. You know, they'll get over it. Uh-huh. Like they'll get over Emma? What? That's not the same thing. Oh, so that's not why you're in a bad mood. I'm not in a bad... Oh, my... <laughs>
You know what? We had our last night together, and we're cool. Oh, yeah. So cool that you're never going to see your special little boo-boo bear ever again. Jesus Christ, you heard that? Oh, come on, dude. The cabin walls are made of band-aids and rat turds. Yeah, let's get there, Ethan. <laughs> get it. Almost there, baby. Almost there. Pretty damn close Hi, to a thousand hey. subs. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, Let's do this it. Is, um, you've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be a lamb and grab the last couple of bags, will you? Yes, boss. Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. Road to a thousand oh, subs, there. baby. We're almost there, Ethan. About 300 more to go, baby. Oh, hey. This is Emma's. Hey, that's a girl I was hitting up last summer, man. I was like, you know, hitting it from the back. Totally. Ah, fuck. Oh, shit. Ah, fuck oh, you, you spider man, fuck. Man, you mother fuck shit. Dude, came out of nowhere. Woo. Scared the shit out of me. Woo. Yeah, you better run. Yeah, mother effer. According to reports from the local paper. Look at this douchebag. <clears throat> Hey, <coughs> hey, what Wait. are you, uh, what are you listening to? Good to know. Loser. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hi. Hey, are you guys going to help with the bags or what? Oh, um... You know, I was actually just working on fixing uh, the door. It's, the Dylan, door. it's on, broken. Dylan, I'm please. I can't. It's, it's, yeah. I gotta get the last bags What's in there. Come on. with this thing? It's just Dylan, closing. please. It's closed, Sorry, bro. Douchebag. Cool. Thanks, guys. What a total fucking douche. Man. Who'd want to leave a place like this? It's like a goddamn Bob Ross. So fucking beautiful. It's nothing but happy paintings, man. Nothing but happy mother effing paintings. Uh, There's only happy mistakes, man. Oh, skill. <sighs> Ugh. Horror. Mm -hmm. I hate horror. Don't worry guys, we're about to get to the gory stuff here soon. About to be a lot of killing, a lot of sex, Man, a, a lot of alcohol, a lot of death. We're getting there, we're getting there. And this place needs a serious overhaul. Hell yeah it does. Fucking messy as hell in here. Huh. Oh shit. Jesus. What the hell? Damn. Is that you, Dylan? I can only deal with one shit at a time, Jacob. And I had to take Okay, a really, shit. dude? Locking me out? Okay, in my defense, A, it was Dylan's idea, and two, it was really funny. Oh, yeah, right. Is that is that right? Mm -hmm. I don't write the rules, man. Okay, whatever. Look, are you gonna help me with the bags or what? Hey Anthony, no, thanks for being here, here man. How's it going myself, tonight? Man, thanks for being here on the Jesus live okay. chat. Why are the live stairs stream? Blocked? Well, apparently it's to keep raccoons and other pesky varmints from ransacking the place. Uh, Mr. H's words, not mine. Oh! Boring. Gotta go do my thing, guys. Take these bags to the damn van. All right, got the bags. Pretty Great. good, Anthony. All by yourself, Pretty huh? Good. Yep. Sit back, enjoy, Guess man. Guess you have to get used to that. Grab oh your God. drink you of choice. So I got Jack <laughs> and Coke right here. Oh. Enjoy the night. Okay, here we go. Chill, hang okay, out. You're not telling me the whole truth about Let's you and Emma, are you, son? Okay, I'm gonna need you back all the way out of my business, Caitlin. Well, excuse me for trying to help. 
How is making me feel shitty about being dumped supposed to help? Aha, uh -huh, the plot thickens. Uh -huh. She took out the trash. What? No. Uh, Whoa. Mm, wait, check yeah. that. First, she cleaned the house. Then she took out the trash. Then she washed her hands. Bye-bye, Jake. Now she's a trash of single, clean hands. Hey, ready to meet. girl, calm are down. You, are you finished? Oh, I could go all day. Hey. Yeah, no thanks. Yeah. Man, you're starting to bum me out, Jake. Well, I... Yeah, Chill. you know, I'm sorry. Chill out. Yeah, hey, you're one sorry motherfucker, ain't ya? Hey, whoa, 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 language. Okay, well, at least I went for it this summer. Uh, <laughs> what's yeah. that supposed to mean? Oh, uh, mm. Ryan. Uh, what about him? He's a guy at this camp who just mm -hmm. happens to have this whole hot, sexy loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at all. Oh, and the plot thickens. <sighs> so she really just dumped you just like that? <sighs> well, oh, we're going to change the subject now. Technically, huh? no. But, you know, she realized that she has her plans mm -hmm. and um, I have my plans and it wasn't going to work after today, you know? And today's already over, isn't it? And you didn't want to try, like, long distance or whatever? Man, she has got you wrapped all the way around that cute little finger of hers. <laughs> hey, Anthony, so basically this is... Oh, but, I mean, um, seriously, come on, she's right. It's just like this a is playing, stupid this, this summer whole game's kind of like a was movie happen. type. Uh, let's see. You make the decisions. Uh, um, love, stability, so engagement, this is marriage, the, house, the gameplay, the kid, whole time affair, it almost looks kid, like a divorce, a loneliness, movie, so child support, pretty cool. visitation lawsuit, mm. surprise Some reconciliation, like and games. I, DNS, I tend to retirement, grandkid, grandkid, games. grandkid, I think they're pretty fun. Uh, so. nursing home, and finally, dying in each other's arms and then being buried in each other's arms like those thousand-year-old skeletons they dug up in Rome or something. That kind in the ballpark? Oh, shit, I'm sorry. That was Ryan and me. Uh, let me see. Ah, here it is. Yours just says Roadhead. Whoa, Oh, actually, girl, that's just a down. generic all-men list. Oh, that seems legit. <laughs> okay, so are we sure that this old rust bucket's roadworthy? <laughs> we'll take a look. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Well, I haven't killed you. Yet. And you're still pretty pathetic. Hey, shut up. <clears throat> uh, okay, so, um, total hypothetical, but if I was, like, a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night here, uh, -huh. uh what exactly would I need to do? Um, well, you'd probably break the fuel line or, I don't know. Disconnect the battery? Without the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? It's like an arm that's all rotary. Mm -hmm. You know, it's under the little black dome with the leads poking out. Okay. Jake, you do realize that even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, Chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. Let me just do my thing. You don't know. we'll just have to find out. I'm just going to break this car right here real quick. I'm going to steal this rotor arm, make sure nobody's watching, and... Uh, got, it, got, it, got it right here. Uh, nothing happened over here. Nope. <clears throat> Come We're on, all good, me, buddy. Nothing happened. I'll put you right back tomorrow. Yeah. No harm, no foul. Yep. Oh, shit. <clears throat> Nothing happened here. Nothing Up to here, see. my dudes. Why did they look like they're up to something? Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. D d d Go long. Oh, dick. Boom. Oh. oh. There it is. Oh, Ooh. man. Good sight. Ooh. Freak. Oh. Oh. Ooh, I wish I had some singles. Oh. Freaks. Mm. I'm surrounded by freaks. Mm. Oh, thank God. I'm gonna get the whole no technology thing, but take me back, world. You would have thought Mr. H could have, like, charged up our phones, like, a little bit. Nothing's ever your fault, is it? <laughs> nope. You know, you should really just save it for emergencies only. <laughs> Unless, of course, is being dumped an emergency? Ha <laughs> <laughs> Ben. Back off, dipshit. I'm sorry. I... Peace yeah. and love, man. I... I back up, dude. Feelings. Just back the F up. Y'all ready to bounce? Mm. Oh, excuse me, guys. Excuse Where's me. everybody else? Why Why would I know that? Mm -hmm. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. 
Look, I don't, I don't even know how to respond to that. You say, Nick, you're way smarter than me, and you're a super hot stud who gets any chick he wants. Okay, yeah, keep dreaming, Junior. Keep dreaming, dude. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Oh, Bam. too slow. Really? Hey. Oh boy. Come on. You're about to get your phone back, aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito infested backwoods dump. Yeah, I've been like- Doors locked, bags inside. Looking to get the up out of the <sighs> Fuck dump. me. Yep. Well, it's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Okay, let's do it. We better not get into trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? He'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. Fair point. All right, let's do this. On three. One, One. two, three! Ugh. Got it. <clears throat> Got it. All about the power of positive thinking. Why do I ever listen to you? Because I'm always right. Are you sure they're gonna think it was a bear? Oh my God, relax. It's not like we killed someone. Yeah, man. Just All right, chill well, out. I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts! <laughs> nuts. <laughs> nuts. Go nuts. Can't believe I'm actually gonna miss all those lumpy, loose springs. Hmm. Lumpy Aww. and loose. This was little Izzy's. Somebody's lumpy. Lucy Goosey. I wanna play a game. <laughs> Let's get you back to Izzy. <sighs> Why would this place be in the news? Hey, man. Get the F out of here. Did you see me trying to do my shit here? It's going to be weird not waking up to Dylan's morning announcements. But I am so totally ready to get out of here because there's killers. is not going to be happy that the case was like this one. <laughs> I'll tell Chris about it when we see him. Ouch. Let's hope Jacob hasn't seen this. Smells like ass. Oh. <laughs> smells like ass and balls. <laughs> and baby, hit me with your mission. I don't think anyone knocked Caitlin out of first place all summer. Ready to roll? Let's roll, baby. Let's roll. Let's do it. Finally.
time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. Loose and vamoose. Ooh, you. How are you so <laughs> Girl, dramatic? you loose and vamoose in your caboose. Confident. Oh, shit, girl. It's just yeah. acting. It's what the people want. And Mr. So you're Yo faking loose it? I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. You should try Whatever it sometime. You huh. never know who you might impress. No. <laughs> It's too late now, anyway. For what? A hoe. Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. Uh, oh! Oh! oh. Eyes on the road, lady. Sorry. 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 I think Sorry. we ran over a squirrel there. <laughs> we okay, though? We all right? Okay, so hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there, what if he ends up being a dud? Kind of like you and Jacob. Yeah, like a loser. He's like actually really sweet then why'd you quit it yeah why'd summer you? fling we're like, going to school like four states away I, he gets it yeah you like hit yeah it sure in. You then just but hit it and quit it you know that's us you and nick could be different don't worry when you get his handle hit him up oh i already have his email it yeah. was in the packet they gave to us on the first day yep email are you 93 what's wrong with email <laughs> i'm really gonna miss you abby Oh, hold on. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, but the lodge is that way. Yeah. Go right here. That way. Why? Come on. Scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? Whatever. We should really get back. Boo. Thumbs down. I've, everyone's waiting for us. Nick isn't going to leave without saying goodbye. Shit, Abby! Oh, damn! <gasps> oh. Did I hit it? Did I hit it? Shit. That little dude is dead. Oh, it's still alive. That does not look good. Ah. What do I do? Oh, he dead. He dead. Should I just step on his little head? <sighs> oh, no, don't. No. Put it out of its misery. Oh, you do that oh, shit. And I can't. Abby, it's suffering. Oof. Okay. Okay. I'll do it. 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 I just ran over a squirrel with a golf cart. That's some crazy ass shit right there. Going like five miles per hour. In that Don't damn worry, Jacob. I got you. I got a full tank of gas. So, oh fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> oh idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? It, there's no signal out here, anyways, dude. Okay, this place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy. What? No. I mean, kind of. Like, I missed underneath. Like, it's I okay. Can't. I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. And... Oh. Uh, you. <sighs> hey, Nick. Hey, where were you guys? <gasps> Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Just gotta get these bags up on to the Oh hey, hey, here. Let me um let me get it for you. I can take uh, care of my own bag, thank you. What? are you sure? Because I mean it's really not that big she of a She can deal. take care of her own bag, thank you. We can both <laughs> take care of our own bag. Okay, okay. Thank you. All right. Shit. I won't touch the damn bag. Damn cool. girl. Gotta be rude about it. Ugh. Rude. Uh, Abby, do you need... Yeah. Can I... Thank you. <laughs> Flirty shoes. Trying to get some booty over here. Hey, has anyone seen Ryan? Oh, yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alluring somewhere. I did. <laughs> I'm here. Oh, 
What were you doing under there? I'm her. Having a little me party? Uh, I was listening to a podcast, actually. Podcast. Yeah. Oh. Playing podcast. Play nice. Playing That's PlayStation cool. 5. What's it about? Um, murder. Yeah, what's it about? Murder, Is it about me? You think I was listening to a podcast about you? Okay, if anyone here had a podcast about them, it'd be me. Yeah, if there was a podcast called How to Look and Smell Like a Butt. Oh my god, you are oh. so childish. At least I don't look and smell like a butt. No, it's a, it's a paranormal podcast. This episode was actually about this place, weirdly enough. The Hag of what? Hackett's Quarry. The who of the what's it where now? What's the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? It's you don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking, dumbass? Tell her Whoa, about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh, man. I don't think she wants to know about the Hag of Hackett's <laughs> Quarry. Oh, can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? It's just this campfire story for the kids. It's, um, there's supposedly an old woman who uh-huh. died in a fire a few years back. She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. Ooh. There are, like, reports of whispers or whatever, and, and this figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Oh, okay. Some people say that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son. Or kill you. Oh. Or something. Dude, I don't know. you it's don't got really the story right. Anyways, just shut up. Haga Haga, it's Corey. Yeah, whatever. You made that up. It's totally. Right here in the podcast, up. man. Cool story, bro. Yeah. Loser. <laughs> Seriously, though, you should have seen the first time he told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. <laughs> I mean, not for life. <laughs> you got to be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Come on, dude, bullshit. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Uh, yeah, uh, nearly done, Mr. H. Oh, to man. It. Test Get that those dude butts from... in gear. Carry movie, dude. What? Sorry, What's Mr. Up, H. Man? You're we like had to famous. Some luggage. Shut up. Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to impress the ladies with all his ghost stories. You asked. Hey, man. Ghost stories? You asked me about my balls. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh! <sighs> hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? Well, yes, I do. But you know. I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. Go get him, man. Go get your keys. Let's go. Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Yo, Mr. H. What's up, DJ Dylan? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. Cool, cool, yeah. No worries. Good man. Uh, no big deal. You can share my earbuds. All right, guys, let's see what's happening now, baby. When's the killing so, uh, gonna start? Chris, I- I'm actually glad we got a moment to talk. Uh, uh-oh. I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> no, no, it's, um, it's just, you know, about the whole thing w- with the... Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right, man. All right. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello? What? Because kids are kids. You can only do so much, your bro. They're almost just... out of here, all right? You're it I think he just called us stupid. Just hold your damn horses, all right? <laughs> hold your damn horses. Everything's man. A-OK on this I'll end. I'll be there to film Scream 10 here in a minute. We'll this is a waste of time. You know it, I know it. No, should I have? He's gone quiet. Probably staying out of the way. Speaking of which, the longer you keep me on this damn phone, the longer it's gonna take me to get rid of these damn kids. Yeah. Of course. Adios. Sorry, I, I wasn't. Yeah, I, I, I wasn't listening. I, I was just like waiting. Like I mean, I heard. I, I mean, I was. I didn't hear what you were. It, we're cool, champ. Just. 
Come on, it's sorry I pushed you out like that. Yeah, dude, uh, like, I wasn't listening to any of that conversation. I just had my ear on the door for reasons. Uh, you need a hand reasons. looking for the keys? Uh, no, end of summer, busy, busy, you know. Anyway, you were asking me? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it was just the whole animation school thing, what you thought I should do. Uh, right. Yeah, right. You, you know, listen, uh, whether or not I should, like, leave my sister with my grandparents since I'd have to live on campus, you know, and my mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. You know, fam our family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important, right? Dang it. Where'd you put your is keys, man? Everything okay? You got a hot day tonight? <laughs> oh boy. You got a hot day. If you only knew. <laughs> so, uh, what, what did you need me for? You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. One well, of the good ones. Thanks, man. But, do you know how many calls I get from parents, letter after letter, with these terrified kids that they send home? Huh. I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway camp is kind of bad for business. Damn. So maybe just ease up on the ghost stories. Okay. Sorry, I didn't realize it was such a big deal. Got to understand the repercussions of your actions, Buster. Sorry, man. It's a big part of being a counselor, a leader. Yeah. Just stick to kumbaya next time, okay? Huh? What's that? Kumbaya. You guys oh. don't do kumbaya anymore? The F is that, man? Good grief. I'm outgrowing my own cliches. Yeah, uh, what the... Kumbaya, my lord. Like that? Seriously, Kumbaya, Chris, what's lord? going on? I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. All right, totally. Man. Yeah. Best to get you all out of harm's way. Let's do this. Let's Woods are chock full of live game and local hunters there, hop to it the second camp's over. It's not safe. Hmm. Where in the good goddamn are they? Please say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me. They sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrapyard during the off season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got oh, her whole okay. life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? I actually could have used the help packing up since we were short-staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van. Put the keys in my pocket, came in the office. Right where I left him. Uh -huh. <laughs> Let's get out of uh -huh. I told you that was where they fucking keys were, you dumb son of a bitch. Make sure they're all ready to go. For real this time. Wait, how did you get your phone back before the rest of us? I never turned it in. Cause I'm a pimp mother- You sure did turn it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. You douchebag noob. Shoulda known. Fortnite freak. I try not to dwell on the past, man. Good. Cause it's time to dwell in the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it, let's go. Let's get out of here. What's the problem? Ugh, oh, dude, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine mixer. I don't know, dude. Yeah, I just see that. took out an engine yeah, part. Yeah, dude, it's just like... And it's not gonna start putt. now, man. It's like... Alright, let me try. What, dude, I'm telling you, all right, it's busted. Well, maybe you're doing well, it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. The fuck, dude? Enough. Boop Enough, boop. both of you. No, they're doing it wrong. Shit. Come on. All right, Come dude, on. Chill. Chill, Let's go. dude. Ah, 
Damn it! I thought I told you kids to check everything. No, we did. It, it should be working. Yeah, well, coulda and shoulda doesn't mean it is. Coulda, shoulda, woulda, man. Damn it! Okay. Uh, okay. Well, uh, look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop. No! Let me think. No. We're not. Y'all are gonna die if we stay here one more night. Just come on, let's... Okay. Let me calm Damn down. It. Let me calm down. You're right, you're right, yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. I got him. I got the keys, guys. I got the keys. Hey, Brian. Come here for a sec. What's up, man? What's up? What's going on? Make sure that everybody is inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? Got it. Okay. I'll be back first thing in the morning. And we'll get you all on the road. You just have to keep everyone inside. Got it, man. Can you promise me you'll do that? Yeah. Sure. We'll, we'll stay inside. What's going on here, man? And a like boy. Are people going to, like, die? Lock the doors. They don't stay inside. And for God's sake, keep the noise down. Like, what if we want to, like, have a few beers and, like, party and... So... Party! That he, uh, said to stay inside. That we're not leaving until the morning. Are party you kidding time. me? Am gonna have a party. Are you kidding me? What are we supposed to do? Well, we should go inside, like he said. We could go inside until morning. Yeah. Yeah, man, or, we're gonna go inside. Or we could do something else. No, man. No, no, no. no. None of that no, no, stuff. No. We nope. should really listen to what Chris told us to do. Of course. Uh. Who cares what Chris told us to do? He's not our boss anymore. Man, he is the boss. He's the boss man. A R T. Why the fuck not? Man, All right, it seems like the stars spell, have man. aligned for us, no? Okay, okay, okay. One last epic bonfire blowout for all time. Oh, dude. Fuck yes. I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's in, obviously. My man, Caitlin. Totally. I my people need me. Yeah, okay. M, what do you say? Mm. Let's do it. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He was just trying to freak us out, you know? Like, um, like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? I'm sure he's just looking out for us. No big deal. All right, yeah. No, Party. I, I, I didn't mean. High five. Touch my hand, Ryan. Fine. Yes. Yes. I just want to go on record and say that this is a bad oh idea. God damn. Bad idea, guys. Ugh. Bad idea. We're all about Ugh. to die right now because of y'all stupid ass decisions. It's gonna be fine, man. No, Trust man, me. it's not. Like we're gonna. It's gonna be chill. Die. Shit. Fuck. All right. All right. All right. Hacketeers. Party planning committee. Let's do this. Um, okay. First things first. Nick and Abby, you will get some firewood. Uh, M and I will go to the stores for some supplies. And uh, Dylan, you just, I don't know, figure out how to. Just chill out, man. Just chill out. Something. Be your, your. All right. Let's do yourself. this. Oh, wait. All right, someone's watching him. Someone's watching him. They're about to die. Got a sniper scope on him, and... Who are these hillbilly looking mother suckers from damn Arkansas? Look at this. John Cena looking motherfucker lover. 
Look at this dude. Damn, damn, damn. Damn, damn, I'm about to drink this blood and take it in the damn side. Look at me, I'm a hick from the north. I'm rubbing this blood on my cheek side. Rub it on my butthole and then girl go lick my butthole. I'm John Cena and I approve this message. <laughs> We're gonna kill these kids, John Cena. When the night falls, we gonna kill the kids. All right, all right, guys. What do you got here? Got some fake ass 80s music on here? Truth or dare? Uh, truth or dare? Truth, truth, truth or dare? Truth. So here we are, stranded in the great American wild with nothing but our wits to guide us. Will humanity prevail, or will we grow ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased like I saw in that one plane crash movie? Look at this chick. She's trying to... Look at her. Of course. Filet al Jacob. Look at her. Rich and full oh, body, this, is a dude. this rare it was a chick. beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate. An acquired taste, some would say. Well, come on, dude. Do you know how to open a what? door or not? I mean, come on. Looks like you're trying to thread a needle with a packet of loose sausages. Oh my god. Oh, I'm loose, almost done, okay? Loose sausages? Jesus oh my god. And for the record, your analogies are very hurtful. <sighs> loose sausages. One second. I <laughs> There we go. And Viola. Uh, I got it. Your hair clip, madam. Yeah, you can keep it. It's not too shabby, huh? Mm. I like a man who's good with his hands. Yeah, well, they call me Mr. Magic Fingers. <laughs> Mr. Magic. Okay. So, if I were a beer, All where right, would guys, I be hiding? I'll be right back. I got to go to the restroom. Give me a few beep, seconds, and beep, I beep, shall return. Beep, what beep. are you doing? Beep. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's my beer dar. Helps me dar for beers. Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, it's my beer dar, dude. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go over here. <laughs> wow, the kids really wiped this place out. Mr. H loved his accessories. Hmm. Think it's locked. Don't know what I was expecting. Oh, oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh, oh, jackpot! Hey, uh, check out my giant melons. Oh. See, you just cut a hole in it. Mm-hmm. You pour in your vodka. It's party time. You just you pour the vodka right in it. Yeah, it's the most fun you could have with a hole in watermelon. Or, well, second most. Okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. Harem Scarum? Who buys this crap? Friends? Oh, yeah. Q. 
can't pass up an opportunity like this. Okay, have y'all ever seen a grown man crap his pants? Cause you're about to. All right guys, I am back. <sighs> what did I miss? Just kidding. Oh my. <laughs> All right, now where should I hide? What's going on? Jacob! Am I? Hello? Hey, Look, man. if you're trying to scare me, it's not gonna work. Yeah, stop playing, man. You know I got the heebie jeebies. Don't do it, man. Don't do it. Don't do it. Ah! Oh shit. Oh, she got me. You're not scared of clowns? Not really. No, they're they're funny. You yeah. think this is supposed to be funny? Yeah. I mean Yeah. Ugh. Well. Do you think it's funny? No, little boy. Kind of sexy. I, oh, cause... You want to join 20 of my sexy clown friends in a tiny car that somehow fits us all like it's no big deal? Let's do it. Let's do it. I... Let's do it. I. Yeah. What? Moment's gone. <sighs> Not forgotten. I wonder where this goes. Let's do it. Locked. <laughs> Jacob! Come check this out. I'm coming. I'm coming, girl. Don't worry. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Alrighty then. Door, buckle up because you are about to meet your maker. Nice. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. The fucking mother load. Good golly, Miss Molly. No wonder he kept this place locked up. I think he'll be pissed when we made a stash. What? No. I mean, he left us stranded here. It's like, um, <clears throat> human rights or whatever. Sure. Yeah. All right. Now let's see what we are working with. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Oh. Hell yeah. What is it? In and out. Booze, Job baby. Done. Let's get drunk Boom. tonight. I want to look around. Go for it. Jacob! Check this out. What? I can't move or else the door will latch. You look like... Camping supplies. Oh, okay. Um, there's tents back at the fire pit, so just let's let's go. Did a bear do this? What in the oh, hell? Oh, cool. What? Shotgun. What is it? A gun. Oh, cool. And uh. Code. Okay. Bam. I'm done. <laughs> Go shoot me some folks. Oh. So you're uh, you're really gonna keep the gun, huh? Yeah. To totally. For bears. Okay, uh, well, I am going to find something to haul this lot back to camp. Get it, dude. All right. I'm in. Hey, I'm in, very baby. nice. <laughs> Got some shotgun bullets here. Uh, what else is in there? Uh, just some fireworks. Wh oh. Whoa. Fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should. No, 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 Emma. Fireworks. 
Let's do this. Let's pop some fireworks. Get those fireworks. You know, you're right. Do it. Fireworks. <laughs> yeah, 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 hell yeah. Fireworks. Oh, um, and might I just add, um, fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I found these like torn up bags back there. They were pretty messed up, and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. Stop. Whoa. Stay what? right there. <sighs> oh, oh, dude. Peanut butter butter pops. Oh, shit, dude. dude. Peanut butter fucking butter pops. Dude, you don't know what these are? What are what the... butter pops? <laughs> no. Are you kidding me? What? Dude. I can't believe it. Um, okay. Um, <clears throat> Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. Oh my God, they're like the greatest snack of all time. What all are time. They? Are they like popcorn? What? No, no, oh, no, no, no. Like balls, man, and they like popcorn. Pop in your they're mouth. They're like their own thing, like their own subgenre of yeah. food snack. Dude, what you know the? What? I haven't had these since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait. Is there an expiration date on that bag? Um, no, they're still good. Oh my god, they're like 20 years old, aren't okay. they? Okay, look, they predate expiration dates. Well, well, you're gonna love them. You're gonna love these balls, trust me. They like pop in your mouth. Oh. Like, totally. Well, <clears throat> I saw a wheelbarrow out front, so we can load up all our booty in there. Uh, I'm sorry, what? Booty? Oh, it means like, um, like treasure or buds. <laughs> no, before that. Wheelbarrow? Uh, yeah. Um, okay. Uh, it's like, um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh, yeah. I see. <sighs> Ladies first. Um, yep. Which way? Let's do it. All right. The inner sanctum. It's just an office. This is where the magic happens. Magic? <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's just make this quick. Sure. Just give me a sec to get this going. And engage. Podcasts. Yeah. All right. Uh, what's it called, the one that you're listening to right now? Uh, bizarre yet bonafide. Bonafide. So, like, ghosts and stuff? Yeah, like, it's like, um... Bonafide, boner. Yeah, like, the, the weird and the wonderful, digging up weird mysteries and discussing if they're, well... Bonafide. <laughs> Boner. <laughs> Boner. Fide. <laughs> Get it? Boner. <laughs> Your wit knows no bounds. Yeah, man. Like, so, I'm totally should serious. Should we check out what Mr. H keeps in his private den of sin? Uh, I don't know, man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. I totally okay, am. well, I don't. I mean, come on, what kind of dirty secrets is the owner of a summer camp full of impressionable young children going to have anyway? <laughs> Not Mr. H, I know. He's cool. It's always been cool to me. Whoa, look at this old thing. Hey, give me your number. I want to try it out. Why? Dude, like, no. You're just trying uh, to get my so number. So that I can ask you out on a date? Duh. I think mm, that's what you're smooth. trying to do. I think if I tried a cell phone number on this thing, it would just explode, though. Hello? Whoa. What? Whoa. What? What? Who is it? That was freaky, uh, man. Some chick, hello? like, breathing in the phone, like, asking for my number, whatever. It's weird. I thought I heard someone. Yeah. Maybe you should have asked them out on a date. Damn it, I missed my shot. Damn. Kaylee and Caleb Hackett. Weird kids, huh? Totally. I like them. Totally weird. Yeah, me, I, me too. Um, they are pretty reclusive, you have to admit. Well, hello. 
Whoa, what is this? You hear that? Hidden trap door. Is that a trap door? <laughs> I knew that there was a secret sex dungeon around here somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet you Mr. H is into some real kinky shit. So, uh, I doubt it. Man, you're a pervert. Weren't there a couple counselors who never showed up? Uh-huh. Why? Secret sex dungeon. Yeah, it's not funny. It probably just goes to the basement <laughs> or something. Open it up. All right, well, it looks like a pit of eternal darkness, so... You're being dramatic. Climb down, take a look. Look, you can squeeze through there. You do you it, man. You opened it, you climb down. Yeah. You're trying to get me killed and shit. Eh, on second thought, I'd rather not know what Mr. H is into. It's more mysterious that way. Sure. Ooh, that's a nice chair. I could get used to this. You better hope Mr. H doesn't catch you taking his baby out for a joyride. <laughs> yeah, man. Dingy, dingy, ding. Oh, sorry, bud. Gotta take this one second. Hello, Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. What can I do for you on this darn tootin' doozy of a day? Is that your impression of Mr. H? Uh, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, I. you're absolutely right. He does need to be nicer to Dylan. And, uh, what's that? You want him to give Dylan his phone number? That's a little forward, but I can see what I can do. Smooth. <laughs> so smooth. Kearney and Max Brindley. Oh yeah, those are the ones that never showed up. Man, are those yeah, it's those because of these goobers that we had to work extra shifts that this summer. Died die earlier in the game. Like... Hey, what's the gun for? Uh, Chris. Mr. H told me it was for, um... Bears? Bears. Yeah, bears and shit. Bears? Wolves? Here? Coyote? Yeah, yeah, he said they don't really come around because he's got the gun to scare them off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just leave it alone. Don't touch it, man. It fucking back up. Dude, we're gonna be out partying in the woods tonight, all right? What if the bears try to crash? Okay, it's it's like my mom always said. If you want to party, you gotta bring protection. <laughs> Whoa, well, man. I think that she was talking about condoms. Yeah. I'm not gonna fuck a bear. The most dangerous thing I've seen in these woods is a pissed off squirrel. That sounds pretty scary. Okay, fine. Well, we know where the gun is if we need it. <sighs> Your call, man. Yeah, man, don't touch it. Yo, my guy, toss me the keys. Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area? Whoa, uh, I'm man. sorry, is that something that only you're allowed to do? Uh, yeah. Hardy that's, har har. That's my dude. <laughs> Come on, what's the harm in looking? It's, you're not a little bit curious? I'm not gonna touch anything. Fine. Don't let me regret it. Can't promise that, but... Got him. Nothing but that. <laughs> Got You're him. using that wrong. <laughs> oh. And behind door number one. Huh. Fashion icon. <laughs> Mr. H knows what he likes. Yep. Sure he does. Wow. There's... Yo. Hey, hey, maybe we shouldn't... Uh, Brian? Dude... Whoa, what the fuck? What These the monitors, end? this is the camp. Huh. Is Mr. H spying on us? No, no. 
I mean, no, no, he can't be. These are just, they're all different trails in the woods around camp. I think he's spying. <laughs> sure. Yep. Most of the cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids, unless they wandered out into the woods. You know, these are just, probably just trail cameras. What yeah, are trail cameras? Sure. People set them up to catch weird, random shit. Okay, yeah, like what? I bet you this kid is behind like, it. Uh, Bigfoot sightings, you know, that kind of thing. I didn't know that Mr. H was into that kind of stuff. Shit, maybe he likes that podcast that you listen to. Secret hobby, I guess. Expensive hobby. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. what else are you going to do out here? Yeah, I guess camp probably does get pretty lonely when there's no one else around. Yeah. Okay, but why go through all the trouble of hiding this room through a secret door in the closet? Uh, I mean, it's not exactly secret, right? Like, it's just hidden by stuff. Yeah, that's what a secret is, Ryan. It, it's weird. It's majorly yeah, weird. I don't disagree with you, but... It, it's It's got to be something juicy in here. Dylan, okay. it's, it's none of our business. And if you really want to know, you can ask him tomorrow. I'm sure that won't be an awkward conversation, like, at all. Okay, yeah, maybe I will. All right. I, I'm leaving this secret layer. Have fun. Hey, you just admitted that it's a secret layer. Okay, and man Get over it. Get out of there before you die, son. What was that? Yeah, what was that? It's that one dude. It's probably nothing. Dude, that was just a guy in the camera trying to oh. kill y'all. Nice. Full up. Hey, Dunzo. All right, cool. Let's go. Let's get the F out of here, man. Thank you. It'd be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. Yeah, they can get kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. They always seem to listen to you during painting class. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, right, well, there's guys. this short So for attack. right now, I'm just gonna go off camera. Uh, I'm still going to be playing, so stay here with me. Let's uh, enjoy this done? together. But I am going you off camera. So um, see you guys later or see you soon. Enjoy the gameplay. Good choice. Better sticks this way. Better sticks? Yeah. You like burning or whatever. <laughs> Think we've got enough? Uh, not yet. <sighs> so this place was an actual quarry? Uh, yeah. Apparently, some of the caves are in pretty deep. It's like a honeycomb under there. Cool. Are you sure this is safe? What, are you scared? No. Are you? No. Shit. It's all right. Calm down. <laughs> so, you ever think about what's next? 
Like, after we die? It's heavy, man. No, I mean, like, the future. Yeah. Sometimes. All the time. It's so overwhelming. I know what you mean. Sometimes I just try to, like, let it happen, you know? What? Like, whatever happens is what was meant to happen. Like it's all predetermined. Fate. I don't know. I'm not sure we're supposed to know. Yeah. Fate just seems so... convenient. How so? Because if it's all predetermined and you do something terrible, then you have the excuse of saying, well, it wasn't really me because everything's been pre-planned and then I'm not really in control of my actions, am I? I never really thought about it like that before. I mean, well, it's, it's totally okay if you believe that. Yeah, no, totally. Yeah. know where we are? Yeah? Up here. Here, hold these. Sure. This view is just... Abby, you're really good. No, no, this is nothing. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is rough, but if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. It's really cool you know that about yourself. Um, yeah, I guess so. I mean, not everyone knows what they're capable of, you know? I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. I mean, of course, I just don't know what. Figure it out. Did you hear that? Huh? It's probably nothing. No, listen, there's something there. Okay, did you get all that? Huh? I thought you were gonna draw me getting French by a wild pig. Ah, oh, got it all up here. <laughs> Oh, 
guess we should head back. I finally get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick. Hey Caitlin, guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Uh, whoa, now, back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Knock it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras set up. You know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh. You don't think that's weird? Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. You know, probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh... What's going on here? Everything ready? Uh, I did see a weird light in the treehouse across the lake. What's yeah, that was going on spooky. here? Everything ready? Maybe it's your girlfriend, Brian. Uh, I did see a, a weird light in the... Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I told you never to say Hag of Hackett's Quarry again. What's wrong with saying Hag of Hackett's Quarry? Are you done? You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick, just in time. We got wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. It's mostly just kindling. No, oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. Uh, are you sure you guys are okay? Nobody got gored? We're okay. It wasn't a bullfight or anything. Though I think Nick did make a new girlfriend. Oh, do tell. Special delivery! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where the hell did that gun come dude, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh... Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine. Fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And, and... We bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop! I didn't even know you could still find these anyway. Oh, hey, hey, cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Emma, please hand me the shotgun. What, you're gonna shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Nah, dude. Absolutely not. No. Okay, as much as I enjoy watching Nick squirm away from a challenge, I don't think this is a great idea. Hey, uh, you know what? Yeah, you're right. Maybe I should just uh, give Nick the butter pops as like an act of charity or something. Fine, you're on. Yeah, boy! <laughs> Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Please. All right. Yeah. Guess we're gonna have ourselves an old-fashioned shootout. Yeah. Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but... If I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh. we'll be good. <laughs> okay, 
So, just so you know, I was an expert marksman, <clears throat> third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick, but if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you actually... Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes. Got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. All right, so is it just me? Is it kind of hot when she gets all bossy like that? I'm always hot, pencil Yeah, dick. okay, thank you. Bye, bye. So, um, how's your little one-on-one -on -one with Abby in the woods? It was... It was okay. Hey! boy. So, I mean, what happened? Well, we flirted a little. She's really smart. Yeah? Mmm, yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. No, 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 no. Hey, look, no sweat, okay? We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move before a real man swoops in. Speaking of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <laughs> okay, please, just give me the gun. Uh-uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. Obvs. All right, Nick, one point. Okay, we're too far back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Thank you, good. All right, Nick, this time for real. Nice shot. I'm lucky. Point to you, Nick. Good job, Nick. All right. Let's see what you got. All right. You might want to, uh, Avert your eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right. Just shut up and shoot, Jacob. Huh. I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Whoa, okay, dude, not with this like, random cannon dude, blaster. That is how you get someone shot. God. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey. Okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No. Sorry, Jacob. Better luck next time. <laughs> Butter luck next time? Hey, I didn't want to say it, but... <laughs> You're both very mean. Blam. We thought this was over. What the? Whoa. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Walk right through that door. Okay. New idea. Party game. Mm. Uh, Come on, people, we might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? 
How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies, truth or dare, but Dylan style? Okay, house rules are, someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose, and then you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So like normal truth or dare? Yes. So we can like make people kiss? If they choose dare, yeah. As long as everyone consents, of course. Cool beans. I mean, keep it in your pants until it's your turn, but... Well, who does get to go first? Well, it's house deals, so... Abigail. Truth or dare? Um... Truth. You really dodged a bullet, huh? All right, here goes. Have you ever slept with anyone? Oh, I... Uh, I... Have you ever slept with anyone at this camp? <laughs> no. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All right, okay. Um... Oh, Abby, oh my God, just pick someone. Okay, okay, um... I don't know. Ugh. Ding, ding, ding. Too late. My turn. Ryan. Truth or dare? Dare. Give me what you got. Okay, Ryan. Your dare comes with a choice. Can't you do that? I can do whatever I want. <laughs> and I dare you to kiss either Caitlin or Dylan. Wow. I mean, I guess both is off the table. Sorry, I don't make the rules. I mean, you literally <laughs> just did, but okay, let's do this. Caitlin, shall we? Always happy to please. Alrighty, who shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Good point. All right, Jacob, let's see what you're made of. Oh, there, there, man, come on. Okay. I dare you to take a flying leap over that fire pit. <laughs> Naked. Oh, dude! Yes! Oh, I will jump over this thing. I don't care. Yeah, I don't think that's a good idea. No, no. Jacob. Wait. Don't do it. Stop. Dude, I say veto. You're gonna fuck yourself up. What? No, come on, man. I got this. Brian, come on. Fine, veto. You know what? Fuck this game. All right. <clears throat> Someone else can go. Okay, fine. Then I call your turn. Whatever. Emma. There. Emma, so you have to kiss... Jacob? Or... Oh. Nick. Uh. <laughs> well then. Um, uh, sorry, Nick. This is not uh, even there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. I choose Nick. M? Seriously? Guys. Thank you, Nick. He's good.
You like kissing my girlfriend, asshole? It was just a game. Hey, I'm nobody's <laughs> girlfriend. The fuck it was? It was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. Jacob, grow up. Well, I guess I should probably go after him. You should probably go find Abby. So, anybody want to play part cheesy? What? Kiss anybody, stupid, stupid. Oh, great, where the hell am I? Is that a trail cam? Abby? Shout again! I'm over here! I'm coming! Nick! Hey. Hey. Um. Hi. You, uh. You ran off. I think that game just got a little too intense for me. I... Yeah, I know what you mean. So, all that stuff back there... Oh my gosh. Emma really wanted to make Jacob jealous, huh? You think? I mean, yeah, why the heck else would she kiss me like that? True. I was just playing along. Yeah. It's just a game, right? <laughs> right. We look? Oh, my God. 
Shit! Technique needs work. Hey. Uh, yeah. I guess you found me that. Of course. <sighs> Sneaking down here was a little more fun when we thought we could get caught, huh? Yeah, I, uh, I guess. Jacob, I thought we agreed that this, us, was just supposed to be some summer fun. Yeah, no, no. I know, I just... <sighs> you just love having an audience, huh? Oh, Jacob. I mean, you do, I can't believe you, the, you fucking Frenched him! <sighs> you know, in front of everyone! Jesus wept! French, are we 12? No, but Nick is. Kind of. <laughs> you know, I love the guy, but I don't think he's actually ever seen a girl naked before. Well, I hate to break it to you, but he just had his tongue down my throat, and he definitely knew what to do with it. <laughs> You you really love fucking with me, huh? Lighten up, Sarapus, please. This is not how the night was supposed to go. What? You know what? Nothing. No Nothing, never mind. Hey, that's mine. Yeah, well, finders keepers. I'm getting it back tomorrow. Fine. You can stand here, sulking. Driving yourself crazy imagining Nick's tongue in my mouth. Oh, come on. Or you can go grab us some towels. What do you need towels for? Well, we agreed. Some are fun, right? Apparently, summer is not quite...
Yeah, we'll see about that. Huh. It's not long ago. Wonder if it was near here. Check it and thack it, huh? Oh, well, check it must mean Mr. H. Chris Hackett. Who the hell is Thackett? <sighs> Looks like somebody didn't put their oars away. Still wet. Hmm. What are these numbers? Probably everything's fine. God damn it. There's no towels. None? There's exactly zero. You dick. God, what the hell? Just get back down here, Jacob. <sighs> okay, well, I guess we could just like drip dry or you, know, you could shake it out doggy style. Wow, you really know how to talk to a girl, don't you? Look, you can't just pretend that it didn't happen. Oh, but I can, because you see, oh, help, help, I'm, I'm drowning, and I, I need a big, strong, not at all insecure man to come save me. <laughs> yeah, well, why don't you ask Nick? Okay, I'm sure he'd love to rescue you. I'm ignoring you. Gotcha. What the hell, man? Oh, okay. Okay, now you're gonna get it. See? <clears throat> <laughs> hey, switch. Oh, stop being a rock. Attack. happy to stay out here all summer, but I think we'd get a little pruning. Oh, you know what I mean, like, like this. Jacob, I had a great summer with you. Well, it doesn't just have to be the summer. <laughs> Jacob. Okay, oh, look, how about this? Um, <clears throat> if I can do a backflip off of here, you let me come visit you, okay? How about that? Right. Hey! Where are you going? Come on!
That was some mighty fine social disruption there, Caitlin, I have to say. Ah, or was it just the nudge that Abby needed? You're an evil genius. Who do you think is gonna make the first move? Nick or Abby? Ooh, good cue. My bet's on either. I don't know, Nick's got the beast in him. Uh, if by beast you mean some sort of mild-mannered baby deer. Hey, don't let the cute, preppy aesthetic fool you. It's like a steel barbecue grill under that shirt. <laughs> so, you noticed that too, huh? So, what do you guys want to do now? We can keep playing. Yeah? Just the three of us? All right, Dylan. Truth or... Uh, I sound like Abby. Oh my gosh. Uh, we gotta help her. <laughs> Wait, where did it come from? This way. Come on. Abby! Help! Please! Nick! Help him! Where's Nick? I... Go after Nick! Go! Okay. I got this. Whoa. That shotgun's got a hell of a spread. Be careful. Okay, okay. All right. Gotta get, we'll get a guy. Uh, can you walk? Can I? Come on, got a guy. Uh, come on, let's get back to the fire. Girl waiting for you back there, Jacob. What are you doing?
go. Abby. Fuck are you? Fuck you, you fucking asshole! Oh Jesus Christ, what the fuck are you doing? I don't even know what it was. It was so fast, and and there was a uh, there was a hunter, and it was just. <sighs> oh, Abby. Here. What? Oh, try drawing. Drawing what? Oh, uh, can you draw what attacked you? Buddy, can you tell us what happened? I'm a little attacked. Where's Abby? Super out of it, man. We need to know what happened. All right. There was... There was a guy there, but... There was some kind of... Some kind of animal... What the hell? What fucking kind of animal does this? Did I, did I get it? Is, is Abby? Yeah, hey, she, hey, she's okay, dude. She's right over there. Oh, because teeth were on top of me. I think it was a bear. Full size bear would have crushed him. There's no way. I, I thought we don't get bears right here. No, uh, oh, fuck. Look at that. Oh, fuck. shit. That black stuff? That's that's infection. That's And it's it, it's spreading. This is bad. This is really bad, dude. before the infection spreads. Why would we do that? I don't know, man. Look at that black stuff. What What do you think it is? Do I look like a doctor? I can't remember much. I mean, I don't even know what I saw. Holy shit. Yeah, 
But is it gone? Yeah, you better run. Very brave. All right. So, uh, Lodge is sounding pretty good right about now, yeah? Don't shoot, don't shoot! I'm here to save you. Holy shit. Nick. Is he okay? Nick and Abby were attacked. In the woods. Hey, does anybody have any dry clothes? I'm, I'm fucking freezing. All our bags are still in the minivan. Oh, fuck, of course they are. So wait, what happened to you? Right, right, okay, so. Like I was saying, okay? I heard Abby screaming, so I came running. Like as fast as I could. From the lake? Yeah, and then and then out of nowhere, I stepped into this like... I don't know, like a, like a booby trap? Like some sort of hunter's trap? The goddamn thing snared my leg, hoisted me halfway into the tree, just zoop! So I'm hanging there, half naked, and then this guy with like a fucking machete comes right up to me, looks me right in the fucking eyes, but I taught that guy a lesson, booked it right the fuck out of there. We gotta get Nick and Abby back to the lodge. Like, right now. Oh, uh, hard agree. Oh, it, Jesus Christ, I can't believe I haven't told you this yet. I, I saw a fucking body in the lake. Like, a dead one? Oh, no, 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 no. Um, one of the, one of the swimmers from the varsity swim team, he got lost on the way to practice and it was, yes, a dead one, dumbass. Of course you did, Jacob. No, for real, I did. I, I figured it must have been one of the counselors that didn't show up, but I couldn't tell, because it was like all, all bloaty and gross. Something's not right. I gotta go get Emma. Uh, excuse me? Hey, I need this, okay? It's not safe out there. Dude, we gotta protect Nick and Abby. Yeah, and I need to save Emma, all right? She's out there alone. You don't even know if she's in trouble. You don't even know if you're in trouble. Are you trying to piss me off? No, I'm trying to save my girlfriend's life, asshole. Yeah, I don't think she's your girlfriend, dude. What? Get... What? Fucking stop! We're in a real mess here, guys. You're acting like pricks, both of you. Jacob, we're keeping this. Nick and Abby are injured. We need protection. There's someone around here. <laughs> Ryan! Sorry. This is bullshit! Make sure she's safe. If she's on the island, she's definitely fine. And what, risk another uh, run-in with Captain Deliverance? No thanks, okay? There's probably another boat by the zipline. Either way, I can make it to the island from there. We need to get back to the lodge. Try to get help. How? Nick can't walk properly. Yeah, I have an idea. Okay, let's see what tonight brings. Okay, here's a riddle for you. What's got two thumbs and is suddenly riding solo on a freaky island in the dark? This fool, well, one thumb, one available thumb. Okay. And it was here, on this strange, uninhabited island that this brave young soul found herself. Okay, full disclosure, I've suddenly found myself on a a strange, tiny little island all alone with nothing to do but show you guys around. So, there's a tree house over there. I'm gonna go and see if I can't dish out some of that sweet, sweet panoramic goodness. Because here's the thing. Not that I wanna go back because I don't, but even if I did, I can't because then I'd look like the super needy one when he was the one who, who stormed off in the first place. God, you know what, sorry, I'm bending. Explore venting. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do it. To the treehouse, fellow explorers. <laughs> so this island is like an unexcavated part of the quarry that rewilded itself after it flooded into the lake. Pretty cool, huh? 
You know, when I was little, I used to think that islands just kind of would float in the middle of the water, kind of like an airbed. But I'm older and wiser now and realize that not everything's always as it seems. Kind of like how you thought you were just having a hot summer fling and then it turns into babysitting a big hairy man child who's all sad because you don't want to go steady with him and write him love letters every freaking day. And while we're talking about it, you don't mind that we're talking about it, right? Why? Why is it up to me to justify my feelings when he's the one who got all blah about it, you know? <sighs> oh, look. The metaphor in the narrative by mean a fork in the road. How fitting. Here's the big question. Do I take the high road, literally, and forget about it? Or do I continue on the path I'm on and keep ranting about my stupid dumb life? I guess since this isn't live, the choice is up to me. Ah, oh, what the hell. We're in it now anyway. Well and truly in the thick of it. Because you know what else? I was really excited for the next part of my life, you know? I mean, the summer was great, but what's next? I mean, come on. I know by the time I post this, Hackett's Quarry will just be but a distant memory, and I know it's just one night, and you have to make the most of all your opportunities, and yada, yada, yada. I guess I just don't want to have to settle for what's around me, you know? <sighs> Abby sees me as this confident person, but really? I'm just desperate to stay afloat in a world where everyone wants to be different. This is actually kind of fun. I feel like this is the first time I've been alone all summer. Kind of like it. I guess that kind of reinforces the whole Jacob thing. I know the plan was for him to come get me, but now that I'm by myself, I kind of like it. Sorry, Jacob, if you're watching, nothing personal. It's a me thing. We're cool, right? Yeah, we're cool. I mean, who knows? Maybe in 50 years, we'll bump into each other and be flooded with fond memories of that one amazing summer at Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp, and that spark that changed our lives forever. Then we'll be like, 70-year-old lovers or whatever and have crazy walker sex. <laughs> hey, it could happen. Only time will tell, Jakey boy. And as they say, time makes fools of us all. But we will be the oldest, sexiest fools there ever were. <laughs> Until then, I gotta do my thing. Sorry, buddy. Still warm. Looks like someone was just here. Quoth the raven nevermore. I guess I gotta do this one-handed, huh? That didn't sound great. <laughs> oh, shit. The luxurious Skyway Treehouse, obviously. Constructed in the year 180 fuck by a blindfolded man who used only the finest rotting wood, rusty nails, and donkey spit that money could buy. A real Hackett vintage classic. Honey, I'm home. What's that now? I forgot the children's bedtime. Well now, that's a fine how do you do. Take it all in, folks. That's the summer camp experience right there, and... Oh, look. It seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. 
I guess one of the kids left their stuff, or maybe one of the guys back there? But I don't recognize this. Did you hear that? Looks like we have a choice on our hands. Do we snoop through someone else's belongings? Or do we open the spooky trap door and die a horrible, painful death? There are literally no right answers. Bag it is. And you know what? I'm putting some clothes on. This is all you're getting. There's something up there, and it is not gonna make me jump, I can promise you that much. <sighs> Goodbye, cruel world. The final curtain is calling, and there's no time for an encore. I got it. He's okay. Are you in pain? No, no, sorry. I'm just... I'm really hungry. We'll get you some food inside, okay? Yeah, yeah. Come on, come on. Oh, man. I can eat a horse. <laughs> well, I don't know if we'll be able to find you a horse, but maybe some granola? Oh, yuck, I hate granola. This will open the nurse's station. Should be plenty of stuff in there. Well, hopefully we can just get him cleaned up for now. I'll get you something to eat. You and I are gonna find a landline. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, isn't there one in Mr. H's office? Yup. We'll come meet you. Copy that. I really hope they're gonna be okay. Do you think that whatever's left in the nurse's office is gonna cut it? 
Caitlin knows what she's doing. Does she? I, I mean, she wasn't even supposed to be working at the nurse's office this summer. She only filled in because some other girl didn't show up. It's better than nothing. <sighs> Come on, let's go call for backup. It's pretty weird to see this place so dead. You never came down here at night while camp was in session? What? No, did you? A couple times, yeah. Where are you going? I, 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 I thought I just heard my name. I didn't hear anything. I don't think Nick's injuries are as bad as we thought. Well, that's good news. Yeah. So what now? We got a call for help. Who should I call? Uh, Mr. H? The only number I got is to this phone. Okay, then 911. You mean 911? Who says 911? I don't know. I... Anyway, yeah, but like, what should I ask for? Like, police? Ambulance? Huh. Uh, cops? Yeah, don't fuck around. There's hunters out there trying to kidnap us. So they'll say, 911, what's your emergency? And I'll say, Help, help, my friends may have been attacked by bears, but maybe not a bear, but definitely an animal with teeth. And then one of them was kidnapped by these hunter guys with blood on their faces, and there may have been shots fired, but not by us, but also maybe by us. And they cut my friend Jacob down from a tree. Separate incident, long story. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's good. Okay. Nine one one. What's wrong? Dead. Well, did you hang up? How could I have hung up? I don't know. You know, maybe you slipped and hung up or something. Do you know how phones work? Yeah, of course. Real phones, not cell phones? Do you know how phones work? Okay, well, you broke it. I did not. <sighs> okay, so this phone's a no-go. No one has signal. Is there anywhere else in the camp that has a landline? Well, not a landline. What? The radio hut has some old broadcast gear. Where, where you do your announcements? Where I curate my sweet summer jams, yeah, and where I do the PA announcements. It has some old equipment there. I think we could probably break something up and get a message out. All right, yeah. Let's, let's head over there and see if we can contact somebody. Put that back, Dylan. I will put it back when we're good and safe and help is on the way. Uh, okay, just careful with it. I'll be fine. Okay. Uh, it's, it's probably the weather. What weather, Ryan? Maybe, maybe it was the bears. Bear. And why does everyone blame everything on bears? Okay, so for the sake of argument, what if that bear that uh, cut our phone line and just cut out all the power, what if that bear is waiting for us out in the hallway? Fair point. Thank you. We should probably tell Caitlin that we're going to the radio hut. They're probably freaks. Yeah, okay, yeah. Let's go. Oh my god. Yeah, we should probably leave that with Caitlin. Well, maybe we should just leave her with your gun. I'm a much better shot than you. You man. don't know that, okay? I might be an amazing shot. I might be. 
Just give her your gun. Ah, <sighs> uh, all right. You're right. Hey, we'll still have mine. If you're extra nice to me, I'll, I might let you hold it. Don't write a check that your ass can't cash. My ass has got quite the bank account. <laughs> Am I interrupting something? Chin up, big guy. It, I wouldn't really know what to do with it, okay? I trust you. Oh, thank you so much, Dylan. You're so generous and handsome. Yeah, no problem. Don't mention it. Hey, I couldn't find anything to eat. The kitchen's pretty cleaned out. Oh shoot, I left my bag. I, I brought you this. That was... Fuck, I don't even know what happened. It was all just a blur. How are you feeling? I'm okay. I'll be okay. Thanks to you. No, no, I, I just helped a little. It was all Caitlin and Ryan. You're here with me. That helps. All right, they're off to find a radio or hey something. Hey guys, what is What's with up? the, um, we the, are just oh, uh, we found another Mr. H's office, so of, uh, just in case. Three hours here. Oh, what happened to the lights? And we will be not sure. Any better? Have been streaming for I'm doing uh, okay. Three hours. Um, kind of. So about to end it here. Wait, and, uh, are they going to the radio hut? Probably. Phone's we'll dead. Have a They're going to try to send out an SOS or something. Stream. We're holding on the um, fort. But yeah. Gotten a little intense. No gruesome death yet.
but it's Did gotten anybody else better. That? It's picked up a little bit. Um, let's see what's gonna happen here, and then uh, I'll probably end the stream. I thought you said Dylan and Ryan already left. Wait, stay here. I'll check it out. We'll be fine. Just be careful. Stay alert. This be our first major death. Will we end on a good note here on the quarry? She died. Cena. Like, why would she even go up near him, next to him? Like, what's the point? Go back down, tell everyone that weird dude's there, get the F out of there, survive. No sign of them. When you find them, run them. And keep me posted, Bobby. Bobby. So John Cena's got a real. To say, but like, what? Yeah, so like, I was just, you know, thinking about like the start of summer and when we first met and the start of camp, and well, like now that summer's over, and you know, is that like the last time we're gonna see each other? You know? I'm sorry, Nick. What? What are you saying? Hey, don't worry about Caitlin. She's tough. I know. I'm sorry, Nick. I'm just distracted. Let's just get through the night, okay? Maybe I was misreading the situation back there, but... I kind of felt like a little bit more was going to happen. Well, did you want a little bit more to happen? D are you dumb? Hey. Sorry. I just mean... Of course I wanted it to happen, I just didn't know if you did too. That seems like such a long time ago now. <laughs> you did want it to happen though. Uh, um, I... You can tell me. Yeah, I, I guess. 
<laughs> Just saying that because I'm hurt. Nick. <sighs> what is going on out there, Caitlin? About to die. We've died. We've died. I think, I I think this chick's going to be the first one to die. I, I can guarantee it. <laughs> Oh my god. What happened? Jesus, where's the gun? We gotta get out. No, we have to hide. Quick. Cena, what the f? So the radio hut has like an actual radio. I thought it was just like for your morning. Night. All right, guys. Oh yeah, yeah. It used to be more of a. It's gonna do it for me. I'm gonna end the stream actually. right um, there. And um, uh, it, let me go know, ahead I mean, it and is still this. technically, but nobody brings their radio to camp anymore. For the next stream. Yeah. But it's uh, weird actually I will that there used to guys. be. I will um. Probably do like I said a part two, part three stream to this. Um, maybe we can just knock it out in uh, one more stream. But thank you for joining me today. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate it. But until the next one, see you guys later. Later, later. <laughs>